So welcome to Techno Dad Life, where we build, learn, and create as a community. And so today's video is a short sort of follow-up to our next cloud video. And so what we're going to be doing is, if you have videos specifically in your next cloud, how to basically convert them very easily in your next cloud instead of exporting them converting them, and then importing them. It's super simple. It will only take a few minutes to explain, and we'll go from there. And if you like this video, make sure you like. And if you haven't already, subscribe. And here we go now. And a special thanks to all my patrons who, without your support, this channel would not be possible. Thank you. And if you haven't already, take a look below and think about becoming a patron for the channel you love. Okay, so we're on our next cloud server and we go to our movies folder. And here we have outro and it's in MP4 uh, format. And so say we want to change this. Well, right now what we would have to do is export it and then import it into another program change it, and then import it back into Nextcloud. So is there an easier way? And the answer is yes. And so let's take a look. So if we go to our movies folder, and there we have outro. And so outro is in MP4 format. And so say we need it to play in a different format on a different device. So what are we going to do? And so what we're going to do is go over to the corner, to the circle, click on that, click on apps. Then click on Multimedia, and then we're going to find Video Converter, and it's at the very bottom, and so click Download and Enable. So if we go back to our files, we go back to our movies, now when we right click on uh, the video, it has a Convert Into. And so let's click on that and see what happens. And so it has the presets, low priority. If we click on it, it says error converting output. Put. And so we need to do a couple things. So if we open PuTTY and log in, uh, we're into our server here. And so now what we want to do is bash into our container so then we can use the command line inside of our t container. And so what we need to put is docker space exec space dash it space nextcloud pi space slash bin slash bash and then hit enter. And now we're inside of our container. Next we want to type in app get update app get space dash y space update hit enter next is app dash get space dash y space upgrade and then hit enter and then this I've already upgraded once already so yours should be quite a long time and so one of the things that will come up is postfix and just say okay to postfix and keep your local files Next, we're going to type in app get space install space dash y f f m p e g and then hit enter. And then that will take a few minutes to download all the necessary files. And so f f f m peg is what's going to be converting the videos for us. Once that's done, you can type in exit and then hit enter. And you can close that window. And so now we're going to, again, right click on that video again. Go to Convert Into. And now we're going to click AVI again. And then you can see here it automatically creates a copy with a new extension on it. Uh, so it's a quick and simple way to actually convert videos that are in your Nextcloud Pi already. That's it for today. Hope you found this quick tip helpful and we'll see you next time. Bye bye.